Hello guys again. I don't know what happened. I guess the video just kind of cut out. Um, I think I didn't have enough uh, memory on my phone, but now I do. I got rid of a bunch of stuff and now I have 13 uh, gigabytes to work with, so I think we're good to go ahead and start. We've also got a little guest here. He wants to hang out. He wants to be close to us right now. Um, let's see. So we'll have to we'll have to obviously avoid with him because he doesn't want to be stuck uh, stuck with a whole bunch of stuffed animals right now. But we'll work with it. But anyway, I started over here, which was my mess here, and then it kind of cut out, and it was frustrating, and I'm frustrated about it. But it like goes on. We'll just work with it. So anyway. We can start with these two, like I did, starting. Here's my Neopets. There are the yellow and the blue ones. They're the small ones. They're really cute. But, um, I don't have names for either one of them. Most of these guys have names, but, um, some of these smaller ones were unnamed because I just didn't have the energy to name the teeny ones, even though they're really cute. But, you know, life goes on. It's okay. Alright, so, over here, over to the puppy, have another one, this is Howl, it's the, um, trying to focus up for you guys, but today, because of the flash and all, it doesn't like me, but anyways, Howl, it's the Thai wolf, it's really cute, even the fact that its eyes are orange, and it's absolutely kind of terrifying to look at in, at first sight. He's also kind of fat, but he's very soft on the bottom, so that's okay. And then I have a Kimmy here. She's got a little collar on here for Pokemon. But it's Pokemon Center. And she's really cute. She's also Buddy's girlfriend. Boop. His nose is dry now. Or his nose is wet. My bad. It's wet now. I gave him a bunch of water and now he's good. Anyway, I have Cedric here. He's my R2 design husky. He's kind of thin a little bit. He's really kind of cute. I got a couple R2 designs, and uh, this is one of them. And I have Abyss here. His mate is around here somewhere. I have to spot her. There's over 110 wolves here. This is the book's a million husky. His name, did I say it's Abyss? It's Abyss. He had a little bit of accent with Dryer, so I'm gonna run with that. We still love him, though. He's so cute. Even though his hair got completely torn up by the dryers, he had, that washing machine is evil. Move him off to the side. Have here Coast. He's my Ozula. He's one of the first Ozula I got. Uh, he looks very, very similar to... Uh, Douglas Cuddle Toys, but uh, they worked on it, and now they don't look like this anymore, and this one's very cute. Still, his name is, like I said, Coast, and um, he's not, he can't be bought anymore, but he's very cute, and he's also semi-floppy. Here's Justice. She's my World of Wildlife fun. I went on a buying spree for World of Wildlife Fund uh, because I kept on thinking I was going to get the right one, but it ended up being like, it's not bootleg because it says World of Wildlife Fund, but they don't have very good faces is the problem. So you end up with this. Her name is Justice, and I have uh, Jay over there, but um, yeah, it's still cute. I was thinking about salvage parts for them, but I don't like doing that to stuffed animals. Because it makes me feel like I'm completely destroying them. Uh, this is Defenders of Wildlife. He's got a cute face. If his face could come down like this. He's actually got a cute face. He's supposed to howl, but his howler is not working. So, ooh well. Anyway, Defenders of Wildlife. Really cute. Um, This is the Talto, but I named her... I think this is Meb, because I have... Or Me Meb. Meb. Is it Meb? Is it May or Meb? I think this is Meb from the Wolf Walkers, and I have Robin around here somewhere, and I'll find her for you. But they looked like Robin and Meb, so I went ahead and I did this. This is also the, um, sorry, sorry. Uh, this is also the uh, American Girl version of Talto, but I called her Meb, and I thought it was cute. Anyway, 
I haven't even seen that movie yet. This is for, this is Maya from Eight Below, and she's Yamako Classic. Uh, she was bought off of eBay, so she was in bad condition. But the owner told me that she would be her eyes are actually splendid, so I splendid it to be perfectly honest. And her fur is still soft here, but it's pretty dry or damaged here, so it's pretty unsalvageable. But she's still cute, so I keep her. And I have a new one, Orion. Um, he has a sister. My sister Emily actually has him, has her now. She bought one and I bought one because I am just terrible when it comes to, uh, influence and, um, telling people not to buy things. And she said she wanted it and I said I'd spot her the money for, like, a couple bucks of it because she had 20 and it was $20, but of course 20 plus tax because tax sucks. But, um... So, we went ahead, and I helped her pay for hers, and I got one of my own, and this is Orion, her name, hers is uh, Rihanna, so she said she's gonna name hers Rihanna, and I thought, well, I like the name Orion, and they work together, and she wants them to be twins, so there you go. I worked with her on that, and Orion actually is a, is a name I was gonna use for a while. This is Phoenix. She's really cute. She's my gray wolf. She's one of my oldest ones. I got her from Epcot in the Canada section. Um, and I saw her, and she had the best face, and they actually don't have very good faces to come by, but this one, I love her face, so I kept her, and, uh, she's been one of my favorites ever since. She's also got this gold necklace on that's actually real gold, so, yeah, she's worth a little bit more now. I've got Jay here. He's got a better face, honestly. I really like him better anyway than Justice. Um, but he's also my World of Wildlife Fund I got off eBay. The other one was Wish. And I saw him, and I decided to take a risk on him, and I got him, and I wasn't too happy. I mean, I, w I was happy with him. I was. I'm sorry. Uh, except for he looks like he's tripping acid, really, because of those eyes. His eyes are so big. My goodness gracious. But anyway, he's supposed to be the younger justin uh version so he's uh, technically justin but he's um younger justin but his name was jay he always liked to be called jay when he was younger so this is jay he was had a little um he had a little mental breakdown in that and here is deneb and um this is a douglas she's the 2012 sasha or sasha or jolie i don't know jolie or sasha i can't remember exactly but she's the black husky uh, she's not Rainier. I would love to have Rainier one day, but I'm sure that will also come about one day, too. That would be very nice to, neat to have, because I think Rainier is very beautiful. But, um, just right now, this is good, too. She's also got the star on her, so. Deneb is a superstar in, in the galaxy. I forget what galaxy it's from. I don't think it's Milky Way or anything. I think it's kind of far away. Uh, yeah, Star Wars restaurant reference. But, um, yeah, she's really pretty and I love her. And we're not even halfway done with these guys. It's going to be crazy. I'm going to try to speed this up a bit so that we can actually get through these guys. But anyway, this is, I think this is a Saf. It's the 1999 version, and I can't remember if it's Musher, or I think it's Musher, actually. But I'm not entirely sure, but this is Saf because it's a girl. And then I have Fire over there, so Saf, Fire, get it? But, um, yeah, she's really cute and floppy and fluffy and... I like getting the Beanie Buddies, so I have a couple of them. Put her off to the side. This is one of my first Animal Alleys ever. Actually, she is my first Animal Alley ever. Buddy did this. Shamey, shamey. But she's very, very old. Um, she's the 2000 version, 7 version, I think she is. But I got her brand new when Toys R Us was still a thing. So... Uh, she's all, she, so she's very loved, and, uh, she's one of my favorites, even though you don't see her a lot. Uh, it's one of those childhood favorites that you keep, but you don't use very much because, well, you went on to other things, but she's still one of your, one of your very special ones. And well, off to the side. Sorry, buddy. Please don't kick over the drink. Um, and this is this big boy here. I don't have a name for him yet, but he has a special collar on, and he has this thing. He's very hairy. Um, I don't really have much to say about him because I don't know what his brand is. He doesn't really have a brand, but it's kind of one of those off brands. So I think it was one of those carnival toys, but he's cute, and I decided not to leave him behind. So I got stuck with this big boy that's really, really heavy. <laughs> Poor dude. Don't even have a name for him. That's funny. Alright, let's see what else. I've got the, I think, I swear to gosh, this is Keel Toys. 
Um, it looks like it. It honestly does. It doesn't have a tag, but I think it's Kill Toys. She's really, really cute, but she doesn't have a name. But I'm really happy to have her because, I mean, it's Kill Toys. Um, and I got her at the Goodwill. Wing here, he's really, really badly dryer damaged, but I really like his face. He has the sweetest little face. Um, I'm not sure if this is Jolie or not, um, but he's the Douglas. He's old. He's old, old. I mean old, but I don't know how old. He doesn't have really a tag saying how old he is, but he's something. I got him at the Goodwill when I start collecting wolves, uh, stuffed animals again, and I just kept him because he's cute. We'll do this in 15 minute increments because I don't want this to turn off and it'll be frustrating. Uh, this is a little bit of Aquarius, I think? Pisces! This is Pisces. Sorry, Pisces. I have two baby animal alleys, but because they're not too hard to come by, they're, uh, they're not common, but I would call them uncommon because they are pretty easy to get, but at the same time you're still paying a, a good amount for. I got... Pisces online because I got, we went ahead and I bought him and then I found we found Celeste here Celeste at the Goodwill and I was very happy to have two baby Animal Alley Huskies so here they are because I'm really starting to collect finally the whole collection of Animal Alley Huskies I've got the big one today this is a cool one a very very old one I would say it's a Swedish elk hound, to be perfectly honest, so I, but I call it a wolf husky thing. It's Russ. It's Yamako. It's very, very old. I'm pretty sure it's got a year on it. It is. does not have a year, I don't think. Hang on. No, it doesn't. I would say it's 90s, to be perfectly honest, if I was being honest with you. Um, I'm not 100% sure, but he's really cute. He looks like a Swedish elk hound, and I've never, ever seen him before, so I kept him. It's a him, but I don't have a gender name for him. Here's Phantom. He's one of my Jag Huskies. I absolutely love him. He's adorable. He's also tagged. He's got his brand new tag, and here's his tag here. They're very, um, it's sitting, but it's also very weighted, so it feels nice in your hand when you're holding it. So this is Phantom, and he's very adorable. I don't know what else to say about him. I wanted the bigger husky, but then I figured that it was um, laying and he can't unlay it. So I will cut my losses and not get it. All right, let's see what else. What else are we getting? Dancer! She's one of my favorites, actually. She's my A and A husky. I absolutely love her. I love her boingy tail. It is Aurora before it became Aurora. Um, and she's very, very, very cute. I named her Dancer because I was sad that day, and, um, it just worked for her. She just worked as a dancer, so, uh, and then I thought Dan Tiny Dancer, and I, I just love that name, I really do. Even though that's not one of the names I typically will use, I still liked her name, so I kept it, and here she is, Dancer. Alright, we're about to turn this off, but I'll show you a couple more. Because i got to get to 15 minutes, and I don't want this to turn off because it will be very frustrating. Alright, I have here Iridescent. She's one of my rare ones, hard to get. I actually didn't know it was rare when I got it, and then I found out I was rare. She's 2008 Wild Republic, but she's also long-legged. And I absolutely love that about her because she's long-legged. And she's adorable. She's simply adorable. And I love her color. When I got her, she was she smelled very bad of mildew. It sound it looked like she had been in the um, attic for a very long time, or in the uh, in a carport or something. And I had to clean her like five or six times to uh, get her to actually smell good. But it worked. It took a while. It took a long time, but it finally got um, iridescent to smell nice. So I now have a very rare. Wolf plush that I didn't even know I got. It was in a collection at Macari, and I picked it up, and I had to have it. Oh, here's my your Scorpio. He's one of my um, he's one of my puppies. The the um the 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 the, the Zodiac puppies, and he's got a little harness on, but he doesn't have a collar. He's Toys R Us. I wonder what his name says. Oh, it's just a na it's just a, na a, a number. But anyway, he's really cute. Um, he's he's not in perfect condition, but his brother is that I just got today. So I'll show you him sooner or later when the next video starts to roll around. Um, probably. Uh, so let's go ahead and show you a couple more. And we will turn off this video. Oh, we can show you Robin. 
Bates, uh, Robert Bates, I believe, is the name of this brand, and she's absolutely adorable and darling, and I love her so much. <laughs> but it's Robin. And then I found Defenders of Wildlife, the bigger one, that kind of looks like the Douglas, and I absolutely fell in love with it because I gave my other one to Kyokins, and I found this one, and I'm so happy with her. But she's a girl, but she doesn't have a name yet. A lot of the smaller ones don't have names, but they will eventually. All right, I'm going to go ahead and turn this off and come right back, guys. See you in a minute. <laughs> 